Hello, hello people, welcome back to a new video. Um, right, I don't know when I'm going to put this in this video. I bet you can't guess what it is. No. Here we go. Oh my days. It is an American number plate. But yeah, no, it's actually... I bet you know what that is. No. You know what this is. Oh my days, it's huge. What? <laughs> what? It's a parent induction kit. That's it. Oh, there's a little tune. Oh, that is so sick. That is bright red. For the sensor. Oh. That is so sick. Oh right, so I've just received this in the post. It should be a Hayward and Scott catted downpipe. I've got to mention, yeah, I'm really glad it's been wrapped really well because uh, this was very expensive. Like, <laughs> you could buy a half decent car for the price of this. Right. Here we go. Oh. It goes down to 2.5, I think. 2.5 inches down there. But up here it's, I believe it's a lot bigger. And seven years later, here she is. Look at that. Ooh. Bloody awesome. I'll leave a link down below to, to get this. So if you want to get the same one. Hello, hello. Right, I'm back. I've just taken the intake off the of the car just to see how much space how much space there is down there and there's absolute loads oh my god wow so i'm thinking of putting the intake in now um because this one i mean it says on their website that you don't need to what the fuck right so i got my car apart um finally got that bit off that was a bloody nightmare but here's the intake yeah. all ready to go on it says you don't need a map so i'm gonna literally not use it for a week and then when i go and get it mapped obviously drive it but yeah um and that just goes straight onto that surprise Sorted. motherfucker and there we go there's the intake fully fitted i've got the two clamps here i've uh cable tied these together so they hold together a bit um running down here we've got the cable tie with the uh mass sensor cable nice mass sensor all plugged in Intake down there, uh, it's not touching anything, it's just about clearing that, just about clearing that down there, and also just about clearing that metal down there as well. There we go, that's really good. I just need to clean that up so that gets red as well, because that was red at one point. I don't know why my hand's so bright. <laughs> um, that was red at one point, but it's a bit out of place now. But there we go. Hello, hello, people, welcome back to a new video. Um, I didn't really introduce what's going on today. Uh, I think just before this, I'm probably going to insert the clips of me um, unwrapping my the parts that I want to fit to my car. Um, but I'm currently down near Brands Hatch, which is like sort of 10th direction. Yeah, my car is getting remapped today with a catted down pipe, a blow off valve, and induction kit. So yeah, I've just um, dropped my car off and I've come to walk down to uh, Brands Hatch now. Um, I'll film some more of the car when I when I get back. Oh, hello. I'm not used to this new drive. Hang on. <laughs> well, I'll film more of the car when I go and see it in a bit. Um, I'm going to walk back down there now and see uh, and see how the guy's doing and just film whatever I can. Really, there's not really much to show as obviously it's getting remapped. I'm not really doing any mods myself. Probably just pretty much just parked up next to me. Probably good. I'm sorry if you can't hear me as well. The road is literally just there. So, as you saw, I fitted the induction kit myself. The other parts, obviously, it's going to fit. Oh, oh my god, I keep clicking the wrong button. No. What's this then? Alright, there we go. Yeah, I'm going to walk back down there now and uh, see how he's doing. See how my car's doing. So this is Slow Boy Racing, where I'm getting my car remapped. Here it is now in the garage. Getting all the parts. Well, it's going to get the parts put on now. Um, yeah, they got some really cool cars here. Can't wait, can't wait. Oh, 
Oh yeah, it's finally time to pick her up. Good. <laughs> oh, this walk is so long. <laughs> stuff and comments driving up. Um, I'll do like a POV probably at the weekend but I'm just going to look after it and uh, have fun with it now. Right I don't know if this is going to hold very well so I'm, I'm just tying it up as much as I can. I'm going to try and get my close reaction and you might be able to hear the noises as well. It sounds a bit more throatier, like a bit more rumbly which is kind of nice. So I'm about to come home now. Um, I'm just gonna prop my camera down somewhere. Let's try and get a cold start. 